In this video, we are going to look at ways of arranging and editing chord progressions in the Cordio app. To begin, I'm going to import chords by using the chord capture method shown in an earlier video. I'll play some chords with my connected MIDI keyboard. I'll switch off the chord capture mode. I can transpose the entire chord sequence by using the options menu and selecting these transpose buttons and play it back. Alternatively, I can use the up down arrow keys on a Mac to transpose all of these chords. Let's edit the C minor 9 chord cell and select the edit button. This shows a selection of editing options. For example, I can transpose this highlighted chord. Let's select the next chord and show the more options. Here, alternative chord names can be displayed by using the arrow keys. So the E flat 9 suspended 4 can be displayed as a B minor 7 with an E flat in the bass. So let's see this updated. You can right click on any one of these chords to either add a start repeat or an end repeat. Let's move this start repeat to the beginning and play it back. Let's change the instrument to an electric piano. I would like the chords to be strummed, so if I go to the chord playback options here, select the chord playback speed, strum up and play. Mm -hmm. 